Previously, we talked about the community voice that runs throughout the 2023 Davis for Health Community Health Assessment. Community voice is qualitative data, which is information described by words and stories. It complements the quantitative data, which is information described by numbers and statistics. The numbers tell a story, and the words bring it to life. Quantitative data is presented in many different ways in this assessment. It can be found in the text as counts, rates, and percentages. It can also be found in the many graphs, charts, and tables throughout the CHA. The qualitative and quantitative data in the CHA consist of new information that was collected by Davis County Health Department through surveys and focus groups. Extensive existing content was also brought together from many other organizations and sources like the Census Bureau and CDC. Key sources of data contained in the CHA are listed on page 8 under the Data Sources heading. This list is a great resource for those looking for more data and answers to questions not found in the assessment. For each topic in the CHA, data from multiple sources is boiled down into key takeaways about that topic. For example, over 16 sources were brought together to understand the impacts of suicide and suicide attempts in the community, as well as the associated risk and protective factors. The 2023 CHA summarizes data available as of November 2022. Because more recent data may have been released since the assessment was completed, we have added hyperlinks to each citation that will direct you to the source of data. If you want to learn more about a topic than what is written in the CHA, these citation links give you a good place to start. If you have any questions about the data in the CHA, qualitative or quantitative, please send us an email. You can access the CHA online at cha.davisforhealth.org.